How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Ace, and today we are checking out Frank Zappa's Muffin Man. So, like most Frank Zappa songs, pretty much all Frank Zappa songs, have not heard this one, don't really know much about it or what it's about or anything, so I'm kind of going in blind here. It's also been a minute since I checked out any Frank Zappa, but I thought I would get back to checking out some, so that's why we're here today. So I say we go ahead and jump into it, but before we do, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's cool. It's free. It tells me I'm doing the right thing, going in the right direction, all those good things. Don't forget to check the description of the video as well. There's a lot of cool things in there. All my socials are in there. You can go over there and say hi. Hello. <laughs> if you're interested in supporting the channel and getting a priority request in, there's a buy me a coffee link. The link to the video we're reacting to is also in there. And without further ado, Frank Zappa, Muffin Man. Here we go. A muffin. He had a run to your foul, but he didn't know nothing. Girl, it really was a man, but it really was a puppet. He had a run to your foul, but he didn't know nothing. That's great. <laughs> Imagine just stopping what you're doing just for a second, just to throw some toilet, I, I, I guess it's toilet paper back into the audience. <laughs> that's great, that's that's spectacular. Man, like this is awesome. So from what I see, this I guess isn't the full song. I don't really know because like, when I went to Google to look up the lyrics to this, cause I pulled them aside cause I was gonna reference them. I. I think it said it was longer than, because this is 447, so, and, and I think I saw that the song was like 553 or something like that, and then I saw another video that was a little over six minutes, so it's almost, about six minutes, let, let's call it what it is, let's say it's about six minute song. So I guess this is just like a portion of the song, I don't really know, if, if it's not like the full version and I need to check out like a, a bigger version, definitely let me know. But yeah, everybody's like, it, it, it looks like everybody's having an amazing time, like Frank, he went up and shook hands like with people in the front row of the audience and everything, the, 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 the dude that was up on the stage that did, uh, I guess half of the, the, the verse that they did, like, he, they, they both look like they were having a great time here. The other guitarist, which they didn't really show his face, they pretty much just showed the guitar, and I, I guess it's a Fender Stratocaster, I don't really know, but it's kind of like a, a tan or a yellow. It's like an interesting color for a guitar, but that, that dude was like wailing on the whammy bar. <laughs> and like, he, he, he could shred for sure. That was awesome, I, I liked that. But yeah, like, it seems like everybody's having like a, a, an amazing time here. The audience is like all pumped up and everything. So the reactions that I've done to Frank Zappa so far, I feel like they were kind of experimental and I don't mean that in a bad way and I don't mean to like uh, offend anybody or anything like that. I, I just feel like they kind of give off like an experimental, like more kind of free form vibe than this one specifically. I, I feel like this is more of like just straight rock and roll and it really kind of reminds me of Jimi Hendrix a little bit with like the heavy riffs, the the heavy distortion and everything. Like, I, I feel like this was the Frank Zappa that I was told about. And I this is like, I feel like the first time I've been able to check this out. And I, I'm really liking this so far. I'm, I'm ready to check out the rest of it. I say we get back to it. So here we go. <laughs>
Patrick O'Hearn, Adrian Ballou, Tommy Mars, Terry Bozio, Peter Wolf, and Ed Mann. I mean, I, I, wow. <laughs> Like that, that's awesome. It, it definitely reminds me of Jimi Hendrix with, with all the playing and everything. He was playing with one hand and still shaking hands with, with, with the crowd and everything. That was awesome. Like, that, that, that's spectacular. <laughs> I, the, like, they even showed the crowd. Like, it looked like a pretty decent crowd out there as well. Like, the, the, there was so much energy there. The guitar playing here, like, was, was fantastic. I, I love that. I feel like this is the Frank Zappa that I was told about that I definitely needed to check out. I'm glad that I was able to check this out. E even if this might not have been, like, the full song, I, I don't know how much of it's missing or anything like that. One of the comments from the video that we reacted to, it said, Cool thing about this song, it's 5% lyrics. 80% guitar and 15% muffin, which I think that's the funny part, but like I, I think they, they, they nailed the percentages pretty well. I, I feel like even though we kind of didn't get, maybe get to hear the whole song, I feel like there's probably more to it because like it, it seemed like they faded in and faded out. So I feel like there's probably more. I, I, I still think this was a phenomenal like song and everything. I definitely like this. I, I, this was the Frank Zappa I feel like that I was told about. Like the, the the reactions that I've done in the past of Frank Zappa, like they seemed more experimental. And I don't mean that in a bad way or anything like that. It's just kind of the vibe that I got. And I hope that's not like doing Frank Zappa injustice or anything like that. Like it's, it's great having like unique instruments like a xylophone and everything. I just feel like that music wasn't necessarily the what I was looking for, but this definitely was. And I... I, I, I definitely need more of this. <laughs> like, it was awesome. Like, they, they, they showed the drum set, like, just briefly. Like, they, they primarily focused on Frank Zappa here, which, f fantastic. I kind of wish they had shown the, the rest of the group a little bit more. And I'm sure, like, in other videos, they probably do. But, like, we, we got a, a brief glimpse of the drum set and everything. It looked like a pretty decent-sized drum set. And there, there was somebody that... that, that did a spin. I don't know what they were playing. It could have been like keys or, or something like that, but it looked like they were having a great time too. <laughs> I, I, I just wish we got like a little bit more time with the band, but I mean, from what we got, wow. Loved that. Definitely would not mind checking out more of Frank Zappa and his band. If y'all have any suggestions or anything like that, definitely drop them in the comments below. I would love to check those out. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It's cool. It's free. It tells me I'm doing the right thing, going in the right direction, all those good things. Don't forget to check the description of the video as well. There's a lot of cool things in there. All my socials are in there. You can go over there and say hi. Hello. The release schedule always drop a couple of days early on the socials. So if you want a sneak peek as to what's coming out the following week, that's the best way to do that. If you're interested in supporting the channel and getting a priority request in, you can check out the Buy Me A Coffee link. Each request is for only $5 and it helps out the channel so much. The link to the video we reacted to is also in there. And I think that is it for this reaction. I'll check you on the next one. Bye, guys.